Here are some interesting facts about the trapdoor spider. There are around 120 species of trapdoor spiders. They are found in Africa, Asia, Australia, South America and North America. They range in size from 1 to 5 centimeters depending on the species. The females are always bigger than the males. Trapdoor spiders are robust spiders with a tough exoskeleton. They range in color from yellowish brown to reddish brown to black. They live inside burrows which they dig in the ground. The burrow protects them from predators and helps them to hide from prey. Their burrow can be up to 30 centimeters deep with a width of 5 centimeters. The trapdoor is difficult to see when it's closed. This is because they use plant and soil material to camouflage it. The trapdoor is hinged on one side with silk. The spider lays out several thin strands of silk around the entrance to the trapdoor. These act as tripwires and carry vibrations to the burrow. Trapdoor spiders are nocturnal, meaning they hunt at night. They wait for the prey to walk close by the door, and when the spider feels the vibrations from the prey, it opens the door and attacks the prey. Trapdoor spiders move very fast when ambushing prey. They bite them with their strong fangs and inject them with poison. The poison dissolves the inside of the prey and turns it into liquid. The spider then sucks the liquid out using its fangs. Trapdoor spiders eat many different types of insects as well as frogs, baby birds, baby snakes and small rodents. Not all species of trapdoor spider have a door on the top of their burrow and some do not make burrows. Instead they build a silk tube with a trapdoor. Female trapdoor spiders stay in their burrow for almost their whole life and they may live for as long as 20 years. Males will leave their burrow in search of a mate. Mating takes place within the female's burrow. After mating, the male must escape from the female's burrow as fast as possible, or risk being eaten by the female. The female lays her eggs several months after mating, and she protects them within her burrow. When the juveniles have hatched, they remain with their mother for several months, after which they leave the burrow and make their own miniature burrows. Thank you very much for listening. For more videos about wildlife, please subscribe.